Hey girls, it's Tony. So today I have a really quick video for you guys. I'm going to talk to you guys about hair care and how to get your hair to grow and stuff like that. Like in my opinion, as a hairstylist, everyone has their own way of doing things. And I also want to talk to you guys about how I kind of take care of my hair extensions from higher end products to lower end products. So the extensions I'm going to be showing you guys today are these right here. Um, I have so many sets of hair. Um, hands they're over here and stuff those are from abhair.com if you guys haven't shopped on abhair.com make sure you guys check them out they are a beautiful company they are a website where they sell obviously hair extensions and you can buy your extensions there right here and then just like a subtle blonde color um, I will say guys make sure that when you are shopping your hair online make sure you check and see how many grams you want to get if you guys want me to make a video on how to shop online for webs for like on for your extensions then click the thumbs up button because I think sometimes a lot of you guys don't pay attention to how to shop for your hair so online. The first thing that I would recommend for you girls out there is kind of try to figure out what kind of hair do you have. Do you have colored hair? Do you have virgin hair? If you have virgin hair your hair won't need that much like hydration. Obviously sometimes you do because your hair is dry but mainly when you color your hair, flat iron hair or do anything like that your hair is going to need a lot more hydration. For that I would recommend a very hydrating conditioner and shampoo kit. One of my lower end favorite ones and believe me this is amazing. A lot of people do not give the shampoo credit. It is the Suave Professionals Rosemary Mint Conditioner and Shampoo. I only have the conditioner because I had it in my room and someone was showering while I'm filming this so I can't like force them out of the bathroom but it looks like this. And this set, I'm going to hold it back here because when I hold it too close to the camera, the like colors go off balance and stuff. But this one is amazing. It's just, it makes your hair really smooth and silky and beautiful. So I would highly, highly recommend it. And I believe it only runs about 5 or $6. It's not expensive at all. So check this one out and yeah. hydrate your hair. This one's amazing. It looks like this. Um, if you're lucky, you can find these on sale or you can find them like at, um, what's that place called? TJ Maxx, sorry guys, the lighting, it's the bottle, so I can't put them on. They sell them like a TJ Maxx, and that's what's really going to help your hair not, um, you know, be as jammed down below. I would just recommend you guys using a really hydrating shampoo and conditioner. If you are, if you want your hair to stay not tangled and things like that, I would highly, highly recommend you guys to put your hair in a ponytail when you go to bed, so that when you go to bed, your ponytail is all together. You could even braid it. Um, that way you don't roll around and get your hair all tangled up because we tend to do that. Um, another thing if you are taking care of your extensions, like for me with my AV hair extensions, I like to put them in a hair tie like this and keep them separated from each other. Or I mean, not separated. I like to put mine up in like a ponytail like this so that way when I go to put them away or whatever, they are away and they're not stuck and get all tangled together that way I can just pull out the hair that I want want to use that time and that just kind of helps them stay nice and neat and organized you want to use a heat protectant guys my favorite heat protectant is this one right here and this is from Paul Mitchell and this is the super skinny serum I have been obsessed with this product since like 2009 2009 2010 when I was in beauty school they had this product like they mentioned it once or twice and I just fell in love with it it was amazing and ever since then I cannot stop raving about it. What it does, and I'll show you guys really quick, is, okay, let's frizz up this hair. See so how like the hair kind of looks frizzy or whatever? I don't know. You take a little bit of this product, hence it smells amazing, and you only need a little bit, see? A small amount. And I'm just gonna kind of run it through. This is gonna give you a hair shine, and it's gonna help it stay away from frizziness and smoothness, especially if you're gonna flat iron or curl it. It's great for both, it's just gonna leave the hair nice and smooth. It just doesn't stay in one spot of the hair so make sure you guys brush it through. Another product that I would highly recommend for you know kind of like hair growth or kind of hair not growth but maintenance to keep your hair nice and healthy is this product by um, I think it's called oh my god I don't remember what the company's called but it's like a blue bomb I don't I'm sorry guys I don't remember what it's called but what this product does and I'll put a picture of it and I'll put a link of it to it down below that one I highly highly recommend it guys what it does and I'll try to do like a tangling video how many times when you get out of the shower guys you have like tangles all over your hair and you want to like just rip them out that one is going to help you let's say like putting lotion on your hair and it just really helps you take the knots out I will do a video on that soon once I find the product I don't know where it's at I think I used it last time and I just don't know where it went so yeah it just helps them not stay not get tangled because we don't want our hair to get tangled especially our extensions because we don't want to be brushing them out and ripping out the hair 
um, because there are extensions and we put money into them because it doesn't grow out of our hair. Alright girls, so make sure you guys check out abhair.com for all of your extension shopping and all that kind of stuff. And I guess that's pretty much it guys. I love you. I miss every single one of you. I'm sorry that I have not been posting. I've just been a little MIA and I guess that's pretty much it. I will talk to you guys later. Bye everyone.